Hey, welcome back to Living in Men Outdoors. We are currently up on Lake Winnie, staying at the Pines Resort. Got here late last night, so we didn't do much filming last night, but we'll give you a quick show around our cabin here. We're in cabin number eight, the Red Pine. Beautiful view of the lake. Awesome little cabin if you're here with as a couple or with maybe a couple little kids. Uh, but we're just getting ready this morning. Chad, the owner of the Pines Resort, he's taking some time off. He's going to take us out on the lake. We're going to try and catch some walleyes. But regardless of what happens, we're going to have a blast up here at the Pines Resort. So come along and let's see what happens. No, go ahead. You need help netting that? Yeah. I can it That's a decent one. Right. right off the bat, that's a good run. Good. Nice. So that's not... <laughs> that's all nice. Yeah. I bet your crawler's not on there anymore. I think that's a nice start. Heck yeah. So, yeah. And that one came on a... a Lindy rig with a fat head. Lindy rig with a so, fat head. Yep. So, that's nice quality, nice fat fish, nice color. Anything yet on yours? Yeah, yeah, something messing with it right now. You get it? Oh, I missed it. Nice. Did it work? No, whatever it is. The old Don Brown special. Yeah. <laughs> a good nugget there. All right, guys, well, we made it out here on Lake Winnie. We're currently fishing some humps in Tamarack Bay. As you already saw, Chad, he hooked up with a nice walleye. That one made its way into the live well. We've caught a couple perch. What we're doing out here is we're pulling some spinners, some Lindy rigs. We're switching it up from a night crawler to fat heads. Uh, so far, the fat heads got the walleye, but we're gonna keep trolling here, see if we can put a few more in the boat. Make one more move around there. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> I might get they're, they're here. Oh. Might be a pipe if it's sticking down. Well, I, he's just a fast one. Yeah. There you go. Nice. Yeah. Good. Yeah. We just needed to go up that hump. <laughs> they're sitting right on the sides. Yeah. All right, guys. Well, I just got my first walleye. Perfect eater. I guess this one's probably 15, 16 inches. Seems like that is what the majority of the fish out here right now, perfect eater size fish. We're going to get this one in the live well, get back out there, try and get a couple more. Good job. They know it's good for them. Yeah. Because like on Mille Lacs, there's launches. There Got go. one. Somebody was going to get hit. We're going to probably swap your color. That purple might be a little dark. Mine by me. This might be a good feeding friendly time. There. Okay. That's a good 
on. It's hard to see a little bit back there, but he's got a big tail to him. Oh, a pike. Oh, it's a pike. Oh. All right, guys. Well, I just caught that pike there. Uh, if you guys like pike fishing, Winnie is the place to be right now. The pike are everywhere. They're eating absolutely everything. Uh, so if you want to get up, whether you want to pickle some pike, fry some pike, bake it, whatever it might be, now's the time to get up to Lake Winnie. Ooh, don't they smell great too? Oh Ooh. yeah. <laughs> one of the stinkiest fish. Here you go. You wanna fight this one? Put that in the rod holder, hun. Oh, Here. that's a nice one. Put yours in the rod holder. That's a nice one. Here. You fight that one. Oh, right. Here. Another one? Yeah. Okay, one second here. I'm almost got this. Do you want me to just grab them, Chad? Here you go. Oh, you this got one. them. He ain't done running. He ain't done. Yeah. Talking crap, just catch it, will you? <laughs> See him bite? Nope. Oh, there we oh go. look at that. Look nice at you one. go. Oh, I'm sure it's a bite. It'll be fine. Why are you going that way? Come over here. Yeah, that's a bigger one. That's bigger. Any time. <laughs> I know. We're gonna stink. 23, 24. Yeah. Got a bite break in it or something. Yeah, there's a lot of them that do. I noticed this year. Muskies aren't real fond of pike. That one was aggressive. Yeah, I bet. 20, 24 and a half. 24 and a half. Alright guys, well. We caught a couple of really nice walleyes at this spot, a ton of pike, uh, but we're going to make a spot change here. I think we're going to go fish some rocks. I believe we're still going to be pulling spinners and bottom bouncers for those, uh, but so far the fat heads have produced the most fish, uh, but we're going to start up the boat, change spots, get back after it. At any given time, you could yeah. catch a 30. Oh, yeah. Oh, there you go. Uh -oh. There you go. That's a nice one. <laughs> you on? Yeah. Yep. At any given time, what? <laughs> <laughs> this is little, whatever it is. It's a lot. It must just be skipping across the surface, yes, it huh? Yes, is. I'm going to get out of the way. Set that there, try not to trip on it. Nice. 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 A little one. You want to eat him? Or do you want him to go back? Do you think he makes 14? If he makes 14, let's eat him. Oh, I'd keep him at 14. Okay. That's what I like to keep. Yeah. Anything under, throw him at. Yeah, he'll make 14. Yeah. All right, guys. Well, it took a little bit, but we're back on some fish. Now, not huge, but nice 14-incher. Nothing wrong with the fillets on that. 
We'll get them in the live well, get back out there, hopefully pull in a couple more. Knock the phone down. Okay. This is probably the biggest one you'll ever see. Yeah. Got another one? Yep. That's a little bigger than a perch. Hun, can you stick this in the rod holder? That's a walleye. Yeah. Where's Big oh, Cam? Is it? Oh, nice perch. That is. I'm gonna take pictures of that here, Dad. Heck yeah, do it. Get a picture on your phone, hon. Say so I spoke too early, Dad. <laughs> oh, that's a really nice one. Five minutes and he hasn't said anything yet. He might be driving. Oh, Chad's got one. Nice. Heck yeah. Nice job, man. That's up to you. Oh, there's a fish. There he is. There he is. That's, there you go. Is that a bigger one? This is bigger than the last one. This is either a really nice perch or a small walleye. Yeah. All right, guys. Well, we've made it over to our third spot now. We're pulling spinners through some shallow weeds, about six to nine feet of water. We picked up a few really nice big perch, and now we got another walleye just a touch over 14. Get them in the live well, get back out, get a couple more. Past week I went. I've never done it. Look at this. Look at him. <laughs> You're ridiculous. You're ridiculous. Maybe it's not big. It's nice, whatever it is. It's a pike, isn't it? It's great for the, the show. Wow. Right on the tip of that. Nice. <laughs> All right guys, there we go, got another one there. Like I said, spinner, fathead, uh, just trolling these shallow weeds and uh, another nice one for the live well here. Hey, hold on to your fish. There we go. That one? Yeah, perch. Roll of a perch. Another big one? Pretty decent size. I mean, not as big as the last two, but yep. eater. Definitely. This is an alpha. Oh. oh that's a nice I just missed one. Could be a pike. Could be an alligator. Snappy turtle. Done. A little 16 incher. Up in the weeds, shallow. Nice. For now, I bet I have a weed on there. Come on back. There we go. Got one? Jumbo. Oh, no. You're good then. You want to reel this one in? <laughs> Catch fish you want to be fish. ready in case it's a walleye. It's a nice perch. Oh, okay. Oh, really That's a really nice, nice one. one. Nice perch. That's a really good one. I think the orange and gold has been the color today. Yeah. 
I've just got gold on. Yeah. Oh, boy. Get one? Oh, that was a nice fight. You might come back. I was holding it with the wrong hand, too. You're good. Nothing worse than a fish with commitment issues. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> that's, that's, a, that's a good one. It is. There's, we bought it that has a dent on the face of it, but that has to be part of it because it just blows out that, that glass. Is it a net or is that a... I think it's a perch. Nice jumbo, bud. Very nice. Oh, you got bit off. You got bit off trying to encourage your husband. Another nice perch there, guys. Right? Pop them in quick. Yeah. Heck yeah. That's a nice I like bird. that one. Finally, I got some for the live well. I contributed to dinner. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Nicely yeah, done, huh? Pumping them out. Oh, oh, boy. That one might come a little short. Oh, oh no, that oh, one's going to keep. Oh, you think? That's going to keep for sure. My walleye. I know. <laughs> I took all day. Nice. Got my first walleye. Well, it's a nice eater here. Put her in the box. All right, guys. Well, we are gonna call it a day out here on Winnie. I think we ended up with seven or eight walleyes. We got somewhere between eight and ten perch in the live well. Overall, a phenomenal day out here. Had a blast fishing with Chad. Really appreciate him taking time out of his day to bring us out here. But we're gonna head for home. We're gonna go clean up some fish and uh, go from there. here to the Pines Resort fish cleaning house. Uh, I believe this was brand new last fall. Absolutely amazing spot to stop and clean your fish before you package them up, bring them home. Uh, we got seven walleyes here, eight big perch. Had a blast out there with Chad. Uh, I think we're gonna fry some of these up in the restaurant later, possibly. If we do, we'll definitely take some pictures, possibly some video if there's not a ton of people up there. But we're gonna get these cleaned up. We're gonna go eat some burgers and ice cream up there. Uh, so stay tuned, because we'll take you along for that as well. Well, I think we last left you guys off in the fish cleaning shack. We talked about going up and eating at the Pines Resort restaurant, which we did. Uh, we did take some pictures of the food, but there was people up in there, so we didn't wanna take the camera out. Also went and got some of their famous ice cream rolls. And then honestly guys, after that, we were sunburned, we were tired. We just kind of bummed around the rest of the night. But this morning we woke up, we watched a thunderstorm roll across Lake Winnie, listened to the rain, all the thunder, watched the lightning. It was beautiful out here. 
If you guys want to come up to the Pines Resort, they have, I believe, a dozen cabins. They have RV sites. They have seasonal sites. Uh, you got to get in touch with Chad. We'll leave all the contact information down in the description. We'll leave his phone number at the bottom here. Uh, but you got to get up here, guys. It's a blast. The fishing is phenomenal out here. Walleye, perch, pike, muskies, bass, panfish, whatever you want to catch. Somewhere out here you can find that. But we're going to just finish up eating our breakfast here. We're going to go check out up at the restaurant and we're going to be on our way home and we'll see you guys on our next adventure and don't forget to get on out there and get lit.